We've always really liked the text-to-speech option that's available in Storyline 360. It's great for creating rough drafts of the audio that might be in a slide narration. And with the new AI assistant from Articulate, there's now another option to insert audio using AI-generated voices in the form of text-to-speech. So if you look at my slide here, there's really not a lot on it, just a title and an AI image that I generated in a different video if you want to check that out. But all that's there is the text box and the picture. And in my notes panel, I have a transcript that I would like a narrator to read. So I'm going to come up to my insert audio in the AI assistant section and choose text to speech. This will open up the window to generate AI audio and it has a voice selected. We'll come back to the voices here momentarily, but I need to get my text in there. And because I already have mine in my slide notes, I'll just select the link to add from my slide notes. I do want it to generate the closed captions for that audio. And down below, there are some advanced settings. You can hover over the information icon to learn more about each of those settings. But I am going to just leave mine on the default. Right now, the voice that it's selected is Laura, but if I'd like to hear a different voice, I can select the voices section here at the top of the screen. I can filter those voices based on gender, age, or accent, or I can just start scrolling through those voices and listen to them preview some of those voices. So if I scroll down here a bit, maybe I'd like to preview Matilda, see what her voice sounds like. Ideas are the beginning points of all fortunes. If I like that voice, I'll select use. It takes me back over into my text to speech and I see at the top that Matilda is now my voice and I'm ready to press the generate speech button and the AI text to speech will generate that audio file. Once my audio file has been generated, I do have the ability to preview it here at the top of the screen or add it into my media library if I want to save it and maybe use it later and not insert it into this slide. In my case, I do want to insert it onto this slide, so I'm ready to press the insert button at the bottom of this window. If I look back over at my timeline, I can now see my picture, my title, and my AI text-to-speech. Let's go ahead and preview this slide and see how it sounds. Reading with preschoolers can be a delightful experience. Choose engaging books with colorful illustrations and simple text. Encourage children to point at pictures and ask questions about the story. I'll pause that slide, but I think it sounds pretty good. As you can see, it was quick and easy to generate that text-to-speech. It also generated those closed captions, and those voices sound really natural, and it's easy and quick to do.